Hey Dreamweavers, it's me Keisha here at Enchanted Dreamcatcher and welcome back to my channel and a another video. If you're new here and you've stumbled across my part of the YouTube universe, welcome and I hope you enjoy the content that I put out. I post twice a week on a Wednesday and a Friday and I mainly post about witchcraft, uh, law of attraction, positivity, uh, with a little bit of beauty and life thrown in for good measure. So without further ado, we are going to get into this video. here the enchanted gene catcher welcome back to a another video so we are still on the yule train at the moment as i am i just wanted to do a little video sorry ignore my chair it's really annoying <laughs> or it may just be me it's annoying that it's finding it annoying i don't know but i wanted to do a, another video for you all like I did for Samhain I did my Sabbath celebration series for Samhain but I also did another video for sort of like low mood or low energy ideas for the Sabbath so I thought it'd be a really cool idea to do the same for you all so let's get into it I have my trusty iPad with my handwritten list of ideas so let's get into it so some easy low energy things that you could do for the sabbath include uh burning um herbs in candles oils things like that scents that remind you of the holiday so things like i'd say probably things like clove and frankincense sage my favorite cinnamon definitely gives that holiday vibe um, so I think that's sort of like a really cool, a cool way to help sort of get yourself into, into the vibe, into the zone. As I feel that with, sometimes they do say that scents are a really, really powerful way to, to experience something, get, get your mind to sort of click and get into that zone. So I think that's like something that's simple, easy doesn't require any, any a lot of energy or preparation or things like that also drinking a nice mug of hot chocolate or like um spiced apple cider or anything like that i love hot chocolate's my favorite i love to put marshmallows in it cream you could um you could put some cinnamon you could put some cinnamon powder in it if you love cinnamon or anything like that i think it's a really cool idea and oh just makes you feel really like cozy and warm and like just just give me just gives me that vibe and also apple um i love like apple cider tea or anything like that um in england there's so for my english people or my british people there's um robinson's have come out with a seasonal cordial that's uh what's in it cinnamon apple and cinnamon i believe but you can actually warm it up like you would like blackcurrant squash so if you put some in a glass and boil the kettle and put hot water in it uh, it's just like an apple cider it's so nice and i usually squirt a little bit of cream on top but it tastes really warm it just it just feels like fall winter in a cup it's so nice like if you're in england like you have to try it it's so good let me know if you do try it like what you think also as well lighting candles in seasonal yuletide colors so you sort of your reds your greens your golds and um, silvers and um, that sort of icy blue i think that that's something that's 
doesn't really it doesn't require much energy but also could just there's something just nice and magical or comforting about lighting candles and that's just something that could just help get you in the mood get you in the zone for the season also if you're feeling a slightly more high energy you could bake some like cookies or gingerbread you could make like gingerbread tree houses and gingerbread men and all that sort of thing and decorate them and eat cookies that's cool but if you're not feeling as high energy as to actually bake the cookies like you could buy some really nice gingerbread cookies um normal cookies whatever it is you'd like you can buy them even with kits just to decorate them like already they're all cooked and made just yeah so just depending on how low your energy is i feel like this time of year having some cookies and things like that is a really cool idea getting cozy under blankets and watching your slash your wall and um, like your witchy christmasy vibe movies like have like your heating or fire on whatever just get nice and cozy you can have that mug of hot chocolate or latte whatever it is you drink or the apple cider or some sort of like hot tea and just get all cozy and watch some movies with loved ones i think that's a really nice thing to do also as well taking a nice winter walk if the weather is not wet and raining nice and crisp and cold and fresh that you could just wrap up warm take a nice walk and just sort of just embrace the season dead leaves on the ground and crunching under your feet and yeah i just think that's a really something nice that's low energy that you could do to bring the season for you also as well you could collect pine cones while you're out on that walk i think that's a really nice idea something nice that you can just you could use the pine cones on your altar you could collect like um conkers or acorns or anything else you could collect nice like fallen twigs and things like, like that for like your altar or your crafts or whatever i think that's a cool idea also as well in your book of shadows or your grimoire journal whatever you could dedicate and write a page um about the season of your so you could just have it as simple as just writing the history of your um some correspondences things like that or you could write about how your makes you feel and what you associate with your you could decorate it you could just keep it simple i think that's something that doesn't require too much energy that you could do also waking up in time to watch the sun rise and you could also watch the sunset i think that's something nice to help you sort of ground you and get you into the season making your cards for loved ones if that's a little bit higher energy than what you feel like you could buy your cards you could get them online or you could get christmasy cards like blank ones inside so you can write your own yule message and send those to your loved ones also running a nice bath it doesn't necessarily have to be a ritual bath but just running a really nice bath and um and just filling it with the scents that you associate with winter so just um you could I don't know you could find like cinnamon scented bath bombs or something like with frankincense or clove or sage or whatever it is that you that you associate with yule you could put that in your bath make it all bubbly and nice you could also have some red and green and gold and silver candles on the side to light um you could have some foliage from outside like your pine cones you've collected uh, your points uh, poinsettias whatever also be careful about keeping them really close to candles if you're burning them but yeah so you could make a whole nice little scene for yourself in a bath and just soak up and enjoy enjoy that and also as well i feel like reading a yule themed book is a really cool one like be a fiction book and could be a non-fiction witchy pagan book also as well watching your favorite sort of um youtubers and things like that like witchy ones that do like uh yule type videos do like a yule type thing which i think would be really cool or like um or if you're not 
or if you have youtubers that you watch that aren't of the pagan persuasion you could um watch their if they do like vlogmas type things you could watch some some vlogmas type videos get into the sort of witchy way or get into the sort of like christmasy yuli type thing i just think that there's some cool ideas and my memory card's gonna be full in a minute and i'm gonna be super annoyed i was right my memory card was full so i was actually just getting to the end of that video and i thought i don't want to just leave it without a goodbye so but yeah so i hope you enjoyed that video and i hope that just sort of gave you food for thought of a few things that you can still do and you can still enjoy yule even if you're not feeling if you're not even if you're not necessarily feeling like bright and up to it like feeling like you want to do a full-on ritual things like that just doing the simple little things sometimes are just as meaningful so yeah i would also i'd love for you to comment below any recommendations you have for videos any ideas of how you plan on celebrating the holiday especially if you're sort of having that low mood low energy feeling yourself i'd love to know how you plan on celebrating the holiday and yeah so until next time keep dreaming and stay enchanted Mwah.